Hello, 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 beautiful people. This is um, this is the Gateway of Light activation reading. Okay, it's about strength, heart, and challenge. So um, this reading will give you the insight. It will tell you what you need to know at any given time, and it's very good to answer your specific questions. Card one, the strength. This card represents this the strength you have at this time in your life. And these are the positive, loving aspects of your being that ancient wisdom is calling you to see. And that card is this one. The second card is the heart. And this card represents the energies of your heart. And particularly any messages or information your heart is calling you to acknowledge. And that card is this one right here. I hope you're having a lovely, beautiful day, by the way. Card three is the challenge, and this card represents the challenge energy in your world. And this is what you must focus on in healing in order to experience your desired outcome. And that card, believe it or not, is this card, ooh, right there. All right, what we're gonna do now is what we do, all right, we're gonna put this over here and we've got the underlying energy, sorry, put that there. What we can't see is that one right there. Okay, so I'm turn these over. Ooh, beautiful. Oh, wow. All right, now what we're going to do here too is we take a storyline. We do it with these beautiful tarot cards here and then we turn the last one over and that gives us our both underlining energies. Okay, so. And then, oh, skill. Somebody's releasing something or skill. Somebody's releasing to the cosmos and allowing the skills that they have to to work for you may have come through a, 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 a grieving situation this can also be self-sabotaging itself the the oh two aces in a row wow very lots of gifts here that's for sure oh wow nurture uh, nurturing is um, something in a child that could be a card of um, future self reminiscing or flames of re reminder of how far you've come this is a card stepping off in the right direction oh wow three gifts oh and a completion there and and oh we got mental jousting underneath here at the above uh, the underlying energies and what we can't see is mental uh, conflict and things like that. Conflict could be internal, external conflicts. But these are our underlying energies and the underlying energies in, in, infinite, in infinite potential and manifesting vortex of this card here. What we'll do is go through the read and um, see how the, the strength and the heart and the, the challenge comes into play here by reading the cards here but as you can see the process as she walks through here there's several gifts here you've got a, not only a, a gift of passion a gift of love and a gift of abundance okay and this is a reminder of how far you come and you're in the right direction because that card to come out last is the completion see how it looks like a finish line as i walk through this is also a celebration could be uh, marriage uh, partners ga parties gathering dancing you know a gathering of souls kindness as well prosperity um important event milestones um and um, this card can be trapping somebody in their mind, yeah, in itself. Um, what we've got here for the first card is the Hathor Light Clothes. Beautiful, beautiful energy up there. Light Immersion, full system upgrade, and a power recall. And this is what your ancient wisdom is calling you to see. So this is what this card basically, um, basically means, yeah? Basically, this is a light immersion. You are experiencing a full system upgrade. The infinite solar light of the Hathors is surrounding you now. This is a time of expansion and excitement. You are filled with unlimited potential. The gifts that were once in darkness are now being brought into light. I'm going to pause it there in the reading, right? But have a look at the gifts, right? Because it literally says they're the gifts, yeah? Yeah, the wow. And like, this is you working, by the way, here as well. And no self-sabotage, because we've got this five and the five up here. So see the underlying energies on the five here? It gives us like the, 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 I said like this could be sadness, grief, and processing that sadness. But it could also be self-sabotage, you know, allowing yourself to not believe that you're good enough as well, because we've got releasing over here as well. But the two fives there, see the two fives as it works through? So we get back to it now. You are filled with unlimited potential. The gifts that were once uh, in, in darkness are now being brought into the light. The parts of yourself that were once hidden are now being seen. Life is being restored. If you have been experienced sluggishness or tiredness, this is now being washed away. Something ancient has awakened within you and, uh, and are remembering, and you are remembering why you are here. Welcome home to your light. And that is in the, the strength, um, you know, that, that which, which represents like the, the the positive loving aspects that your ancient wisdom 
and ancients are calling you to see you know and and you're surrounded by that light you know that beautiful light and that 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 card up here is like um hathor you know and it's known as het huhuru which means house of horus is an egyptian cow and solar goddess associated with the sky and fertility worship the, of this enigmatic uh, figure goes all the way back to the third millennium bce you know hathor is easily recognized in egyptian art for that she often wears a sun disc on her head that is held in place by two horns relating to the cow sacred symbol of the motherhood she is a divine consort of the hawk-headed deity Horus, allowing her bridge to this world and the cosmic realms and, and bring in that infinite light of the sun, yeah? What a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful card to have, yeah? Oh, wow. Absolutely beautiful. Right, the thing is, I want you to see, right? So, this card here, the Hathors, is right there, right? And, and the one before it in the deck is this one. So, it's like in the process of of the way things are supposed to go and because you've got full system upgrade here and solar light upgrade and the confirmation in between the spirit guides because this was in the heart and uh, this was in the strength and now this is the heart you know and this is what your heart is calling you to acknowledge which in itself is confirmation and, and confirmation of the great lessons and look at the gifts that are bestowed upon you and the confirmation that you're on the right progress is right there and remembering how far you've come you know and allowing this anguish to um basically release as you can see that there because the finish line is right there all right anyway we'll jump back here. i love this reading this is one of my favorite readings all right this card here is like um as you can see halls of learning spirit guides confirmation uh, great lessons a beautiful like hall there beautiful hall wow beautiful it's like a library as well in the background there ah beautiful all right so this card is like um you know the halls of learning also sometimes known as the great halls uh, are an etheric uh, retreat dedicated to spiritual knowledge they are training they are training space for all souls including those on on earth spirit guides and and those between lives they have been visited by many spiritual seekers seers and mediums over the years and have been described as a giant uh, somewhat gothic university building with marble flooring spiral staircases and and tall bookcases some have said these halls are home to the akashic records while others have wondered if they are connected to the halls of Amenti. I can confirm that these are actually two different retreats. Wow. Ultimately, this is an etheric retreat, is an ancient mystery school, and is particularly powerful for those who are opening up their psychic and clairvoyant abilities. Oh, wow. If this gateway comes to often to you often, it brings confirmation that your psychic gifts are strengthening, yeah? Wow, your psychic gifts are strengthening. All right, the message that comes with it, the oracle message of that card, is you are on the path of great learning spiritual beings are drawing close to support you if you are facing challenge, challenging or difficult circumstances or have just moved through such a time you are being called to review what you have learned about yourself look at this right gift 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 and the right direction in order to get so the gift the gift review it you're on the right direction in order to gain that abundance and have that finish line see gift gift uh, reminiscing and thinking looking back but how far you've come in order to get that step off in the right direction and see what's on the horizon in this card here which is the three of wands and then have that gift of abundance abundance comes in nobody knows what the divine the spirit gods um you know um look like you know spirit guides and 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 and, and all of that sort of stuff so and so you have to draw them as hands because how could you draw something so beautiful right and so yeah so the sky opens up and gives you this gift of emotion this gift gift of um love and then this gift of passion and this gift of drive and determination and willpower and spirituality aces are, uh they represent uh, passion and spiritual spirit, spirit inspiration spirituality and willpower wow i got really excited for this reading um this is emotional life like love relationship and connections and like unconscious creativity and intuition and then it leads well there's a massive sign there right in the background there made me jump um this leads to the pentacles which are like uh, material aspects of life um, and beautiful, 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 yeah, beautiful, beautiful, yeah, you're on the great, so you're on the great path to, to, on, see, look, he's on the great path, see, we're just going to go back over what it says here and show you how these cards work, so you are on the great path to learning, so you're on the great path to learning these gifts, right, because that's what the uploads are in life, yeah, because we've got the confirmations here and the full system upgrades of the power recall and the, and the, 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 the willpower of that solar light upgrade, yeah, the solar being the sun, the sun is Lord, Lord is life, life is God, and what is beautiful is absolutely divine, so it gives us the divination, right, and you're drawing close to support you and you can see that support here in itself you've been working very hard on it yeah um if you are facing challenges or difficulty circumstances facing challenges or difficulty circumstances yeah right um 
you've just moved through such a time you are being called to review what you have learned which is the gifts and the upgrades in order to still if you're still feeling overwhelmed by a certain event or asking why it happened call on source and your guides to reveal to you the pattern trauma or wound that has contributed to the challenge yeah because that's what that is there but you're working hard on to release it you can see that there and it allows this this um, conflict to go away on the almost swore then if you aren't experiencing challenging energy the reason is that you've made huge progress on your spiritual journey yeah look this is a card of releasing to the divine and releasing surrendering to the will of the cosmos embracing embracing the new realigning your heart to purpose spiritual teaching this is in enlightenment see how it's enlightened there um and sacrifice and wisdom being found and you've been working hard on that you're there and look at the gifts coming in because this is the holy grail here by the way and and this is the gift of of inspiration and, 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 and having that that beautiful uh, over over abundant cup of love of 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 of, of all, all of this you know so much so that so this yeah where, where we, um and, and so that your perspective has shifted so much that you view it, that you can view every challenge as a window of opportunity the halls of learning gateway indicates that your spiritual gifts are developing at this time which is that's what your heart is calling to you to acknowledge that you've been working hard and your gifts they're they're turning into this abundance here and there's the finish line there in itself absolutely beautiful 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 you have an infinite potential and you're manifesting that that gateway of activation that 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 vortex you know and the gateway of light in itself we're going to go through now to the challenge yeah? and this card represents the challenging energy in your world and it's like um th this is what you must focus on in healing to to in order to experience the desired outcome that you want and that's the solar light upgrade here and th that basically is the solar solar plexus chakra in a fire and willpower yeah absolutely beautiful absolutely beautiful we're just going to find the card to make sure we give them the right thing here yeah, solar light upgrade yeah all right now this card it means like um i'll go through the meaning first and then i'll give the message this is the solar plexus chakra is found just above the belly button in the pit of the stomach it's the energetic gateway that governs our gut and our instincts and on the energetic level our willpower and drive yeah boom this space um, can be described as a glowing sun it is a space of warmth that gives us the necessary focus and energy to fulfill our purpose and realize our dreams when the solar light gateway opens our solar plexus becomes an infinite well of light in the pit of our being this is a source of daily inspiration and ancient wisdom when we feel our willpower increasing we're remembering that we have prepared for many incarnations the opportunities we have today wow so you can see how that's in the challenge yeah the challenge we've got the strength the heart and now the challenge you know that represents the energy of the world and that's literally what it's saying there the energy of the the solar plexus maybe in your gut your feelings and things like that and that infinite well of light yeah um and in order to experience the desired outcome that you want and have this beautiful completion and learn those upgrades in order to be the best spiritual version of yourself and have the full service uh, system upgrades you know and and that's confirmation if you're looking for confirmation you just received it in this message however this is the message the oracle message that goes with this card which is uh, what this card actually means the light of the great central sun is shining on you activating you to push forward onward and create this is a perfect time to move forward with projects goals and intentions align your energy with whatever you are ready to create and experience focus on what you are ready to grow and where you are ready to expand as you focus on your goals you are giving them energetic encouragement to flourish and open like the warm summer sun kissing the ground encouraging the flowers to grow and bloom that sunlight has arrived it's here and now in you wow that is beautiful what amazing reading what a beautiful reading this oh i love this reading this is one of my favorite readings that i do um as you can see in the cards here alone that you are so close you are working so hard you can see he's working there um seven is uh, the seven of pentacles is like sitting there pondering and thought and thinking about it and waiting for your fruition this is mastering the skill you know and then to have three gifts of the ace that ace the ace the ace is a the new beginnings new potentials but they're the gifts from the divine and you can see that you know you're reminiscing on on the fact of how far you've come as a as an amazing person maybe even your inner child here just comes out in you and that's the, the right direction and stepping off in that right direction and, and and right foot and walking with spirit being divinely led and 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 having that beautiful faith in the in the system and and walking through 
you know our world and 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 having these gifts come in because you can see that gifts uh, and the completion there and don't allow you know these conflicts in your mind or conflicts even around you to create these situations of sadness or regret or or or, or you know or negative patterns or negative emotions and wallowing and self-pity to stop these beautiful blessings that the vine is trying to give you yeah i want you to have a lovely beautiful day that's more reading that i got for you we have a lovely beautiful day and may your blessings be as beautiful as your lovely beautiful heart which means manifest uh, use your ambitions your prosperity and manifest new energies and ascension and upgrades and start a new familiar you know be get those new levels of consciousness and and have that wholeness and completion and joy and have that you know energy and that spiritual awakening that redemption and answer the call to your soul you know beautiful universe we live in have a lovely beautiful and amazing day take care bye bye